A tradition returns to Northwest Arkansas this holiday season with a Christmas Carol over at Theater Squared. And that's actually where Jason is today. He's joining us with a preview of what you can expect at this year's show. Do we have Jason? Jason, can you hear me? There we go. Yes, hey. Hey, Jackie. Oh, my goodness. I'm on the magical set right now at Theater Squared of A Christmas Carol, and I can't wait for you at home to meet a few members of the cast. So let's go meet them. We've got Yatunde, Beatrice, and Stephanie joining me. Thanks for being here, everybody, waking up early. <laughs> no problem. So <laughs> you are famous. Tell us what characters you all play on the show. I play the librarian, and I also play Mrs. Cratchit. Mm -hmm. Tiny Tim. I play the ghost of Christmas past and Belle. So we have several characters represented on the show. Now, you may have noticed we are in what looks like a library, and the library is a really key component to this show. That's where your character comes in. Tell us why the library is such a staple for this particular production. Well, I think because this production embraces A Christmas Carol as a story. Um, when Charles Dickens wrote the story back then, it was, a, it was a huge bestseller. And so I think embracing the story as a book and, and a story to be told is what makes this library really come alive. Absolutely. And something interesting I learned, there are over 400 books in this library that were made by the company. And check this out. I don't know if you can get a shot of this, right? You think it's several books here, one book. Look at that. It's one unit. And the whole company came together to put these together. And that's just some of the magic that you'll find here on the set. Now, I've got a couple of questions, maybe for you, Tiny Tim. Tiny Tim, what is your favorite part of this show? Um, I think my favorite part is in present where um, to um, where Scrooge is trying to get the torch and he calls around like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that sounds fun. And you know what? I also heard, you know, this deals with some magic and some kind of creepy stuff at times. Are there any moments that really frighten you that you have to turn away from? Well, maybe not really, but maybe Molly seen a little bit. Okay. <laughs> okay, yes. What about for you? Do you have a favorite moment in this show? Maybe it's something you're part that you're in or perhaps it's a moment that you watch somebody else do something? Um, I think my favorite moment is when the change is realized in Scrooge, when he's gotten the lesson from all the ghosts and you see the transformation that he's gone from Scrooge to um, this really open, loving, caring man. And I think even as an actor, every night I'm just impressed at the, uh, the actor who plays Scrooge, James Odom, his ability to just transform. And so that's my favorite part every night. Yeah, I hear that. This is your first time in Northwest Arkansas, right? How, how are you finding it here? I'm already plotting on how to come back. I love it here. The people are warm. The scenery, the trails, it's just amazing. I might move here. Just, <laughs> okay. just. We would love to have you. But let's go meet, talk to Stephanie down here, who has been with us before, right? Because you were in the show Tiger Style. I was, yes, in uh, 2022. Mm -hmm. How do you find it being back here this time of year? It's so magical. I, I remember coming here um, and it was, I think it was February and March last time. And so to come here over the holidays is so nice and to be welcomed back to this really lovely family. Um, I worked in the other space at Theater Squared last time. So to be on the big stage here now is really cool too. Yeah, it's cool. I think we've got some details we can pull up on your screen at home about when you can see the show. It's running all the way through Christmas Eve. And before we get out of here, I gotta show you something else that's magical about this set because I hear Jacob Marley is right over here in this area, maybe around around here. I don't know. Hang on. I'm going to go see if I can get him to come out. Sending it back to you in studio, Jackie. Whoo. 